Uh, welcome back to my stupid little channel, whatever. Um, update on the four-wheeler. Um, I, I got the new belt on, the seals, the clutch cover seals, all that good business. I ordered new magnets for the hubs because if you watch my previous videos, I was having issues with the four-wheel drive. I installed the new magnet on this side. This has uh, new armature plates. And then the Hillard clutch inside of it, really, really good shape. So that should not be an issue. And I tested it last night and bam, I had four wheel drive. It was working. So I was like, sweet. So today I went and I got fluid for the hubs and also for the gears. And I come home and I put it all together and then bam, it's not working again. So me being me got really frustrated um, knowing that the left side will engage at higher RPM, and it still does. And I over-revved the engine like crazy, and all of a sudden, this side snapped in, and I ended up sandblasting my face, and it was not a good time. But that's, I, I, I don't think that's how the four-wheel drive in these machines are supposed to work. I think they should engage at a slightly lower RPM than Redline. Uh, so um, I'm kind of stuck at this point. I I'm, I think I'm gonna give my brain a little little break. Uh, apologize for the mess. Uh, <laughs> winter is just over here, and uh, we've been playing with the little kids' toys. So, but yeah. Anyways, that's where we're at with this thing. Uh, <laughs> If anybody has any idea as to what might what might be the problem, definitely please let me know. Send me a message, leave a comment, whatever. I would greatly appreciate it.